What's up, everybody? I'm Damon Hatfield here with Jonathan Dornbush, and we are big fans of the documentary series John Wick. Yes. We've just learned today that Stars uh, does have a John Wick television series in development. It's called The Continental, which yes. is the, the big hotel where they uh, sort of do a lot of their business. This, mm -hmm. this League of Assassins do a lot of their business in the movies. Uh, but this show is going to be set in LA, yeah, the op opposite side of the country from New York, where the movies are largely set. No idea if Keanu Reeves will appear on the television series. However, uh, the writer and showrunner will be Chris Collins, who has worked on Sons of Anarchy and The Wire, and Chad Stahelski, who co-directed John Wick 1 and directed John Wick 2 himself, yeah. will direct the pilot. So, Jonathan, first yes. impressions. Uh, I'm excited because the John Wick movies are some of my favorite action movies of the last few years. Mm -hmm. And they really know how to nail that awesome, amazing action. And they have this really cool, interesting lore in them. Yeah. That they, they're really good about showing you, but not telling you how every little bit of it works. And especially the Continental sort of the focal point of all of that. Exactly, yeah. It was kind of a nice surprise coming into the first movie, I think, because we just thought, oh, it's a badass action movie sure. with Keanu Reeves. Yeah. Uh, but then we didn't realize that there's this whole secret society, and this yes. whole world of assassins going on. That's like, yeah. ooh, that's really intriguing. Yeah, and you do you got, want to explore that more in a television series? So with, I do, with and other I other characters. Yes, I like the idea of learning more of what it is to be an assassin in this world, mm -hmm. and to maybe even work at the hotel. But I don't want them to tell me what all the things mean in this world of underground assassins. You want to keep some of it a mystery. Yes, like they they have the gold coins that they use as a currency, yeah. and even the director Chad Stahelski, I mm -hmm. believe, uh, he said right back when the original John Wick came out. I don't need to tell you where the coins come from, I don't exactly. need to tell you what they mean, and I don't want this show to do that. That would be my worry, is that to fill time, they want to dive deep into every little bit of the lore. I don't need you to do that. Yeah. But having it on a weekly basis could be really fun. I think, yeah, I think there is a lot to explore in this world, although I agree with you, I don't I don't need everything explained away from me. Yes. Uh, but one thought I had was that I love the character, the Punisher. Yeah. I've always loved the Punisher, and I think like the John Wick movies are the best Punisher movies Absolutely. ever made. Yeah. Uh, and I love John Bernthal's portrayal of the Punisher in the Netflix series. He's fantastic. But I thought the full Punisher series, I, I just found it boring. At the end yeah. of the day, it was just, it was there wasn't enough action, wasn't it enough punishing, too much shocking, not, <laughs> not enough punishing. Punch. Uh, <laughs> so I would worry about translating these great action movies into our, maybe, I'm just guessing it would be an hour long assume, weekly yeah. series. Uh, they have a hard time translating you know, high octane action movies into hours and hours and hours long TV shows. Yeah, what's great about John Wick is you know you're in for a two hour contained story yeah, and you exactly. get bits of there being this more to this world, but that's it. And I'm worried that a show, if they give it a short episode order, it might work. If it's yeah. six episodes per season, that could work. But like you were saying, The Punisher, it drags, it's 12, 13 episodes. Yeah. It takes too long to get to the best moment of yeah. the show. But maybe that's where uh, John Wick has an advantage over The Punisher because it does have this interesting yes. lore. Uh, this mysterious world that we can explore that the Punisher yeah. doesn't really have. It's just, just an angry guy that's out to get, you know, just out to punish some people. Yeah, that's and here is. he also has a coat. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. He does have a coat. I, I do love that sort of, they can't have violence in the hotel. Yeah, They have exactly. to be prone and proper. There are certain rules and guidelines that they have. You could explore that more and I think it could be really interesting. Yeah. I just don't want to get too into the nuts and bolts of that world, otherwise it, it takes the magic away. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. All right, so the Continental TV series is currently just in development at Stars. It has not been officially greenlit yet, but we want to know what you want to see in the John Wick possible television series. And as soon as we get more information, we'll share it with you right here at IGN.